And boys and girls, before you even do your explanation of evidence, Ms. Rogers forgot to bring up a very important part. Um, you're going to talk about the reason. So your topic sentence, your reasons are the um, things that make you, um, that support your topic sentence. So it's kind of like those, um, when you think about, I always tell you guys, when you're writing a paragraph or anything, it's kind of like a sandwich. So your topic sentence is that first slice of bread. And those reasons that you have there are your um, different things, so your your meats and your cheese and your um, vegetables. So you have to have your reasons and then your explanation or textual evidence comes to support those reasons. So you're just not saying so-and-so and so-and-so. -and -so. You have to make sure, because it's not just opinion, you're making sure that you're explaining that with your evidence, okay? And then that text evidence there, we're going to leave this blank for right now, okay? But your evidence of uh, explanation of evidence is here. So you should have your topic sentence, boys and girls. You're going to fill out your reasons and your explanation and your per precise vocabulary, okay, boys and girls? So um, good job. That is the end of our writing lesson. Um, you're going to plan this out, and this is going to help you guys as we move forward in our informational um paragraph plan throughout this unit. Okay, boys and girls, until next time.